Foundation donates to Christian Achu Orphanage Home. According to the president of the foundation, in their courtesy visit to the children's home, Mr. Stanley Chedi, in his interview with the media, established on their main goal since 2017, when the organization began, and their impactful works, which is to extend a helping hand to the less privileged, straight children, widows and widowers, by letting them know that there is hope regardless of their current situation. Chedi Foundation supported the children home with items such as stationery, drinks, biscuits and many others. Mr. Stanley encouraged everyone going through any form of homelessness to be hopeful in humility and rest assured that God is still on their case. Today, Chedi Foundation, we came to the Christian Achu um, orphanage home and we're here to extend a hand according to james chapter 1 verse 27 it says that the pure religion that the lord seeks from us is to be a help to the orphanage the less privileged and those who are in need and so we are here to extend a hand to them in this season and time that these children are missing and they are giving them the support and the education they need. We are also here to give them a cushion to let them know we are here for them. And to also remember our icon who has been there for this nation and the great work he is doing that even though he is not here, we are also here to give a little hand to push the vision and support the kids to be able to attain whatever he envisaged for them today. And so we came here with a little support with my team and my wonderful director also here and the people behind me here uh, we're just here to extend a hand to the wonderful children that god has given to this nation to help them to fulfill what they are we have been established since 2017 and in every year we do three donations and the first one uh, is to women who are widows and widowers and also single parents we give them skill training so that they can equip themselves like liquid soap baking and their own meat pie cakes and stuff like that so that they can have something to do on their own and then the, the second one which is as we do in july but because of the weather conditions we had to shift it to august which is this month that we came here and then we also do a december donation to orphanages also so in every year we do three donations in the year but we established and started in 27. today we brought some um stationery for the kids so that they can help their education also we brought some foodstuffs also to give them a little energy as they are going their day to day and brought some drinks and, and biscuits to also support them and as they also have lunch and all that stuff also and we brought some um, books also written by one woman of god to also give them knowledge as they are um, going through the ladder of academics also to equip them and also give them knowledge and the fear of god also to let them know that in all they need God in every aspect of their life also. So anyone watching me out there without a father or without a mother or without any family or support around you or you chance by it on the street or on the internet and you're watching me, listen, there is hope for you. And one day you will get somebody that will be there for you. But remember to humble yourself wherever you go because if somebody will be there for you, you must be ready to humble yourself to also receive what they have for you. And God bless you wherever you are. Be strengthened and be empowered and know that God is still on your case. You are the next miracle in town. Don't. We call for partnership in every way. Chedi Foundation, we are on Facebook. You can reach us there. And we are also on um, Instagram. We are also on IG. We are also on TikTok. You can reach us. The same name is Chedi Foundation. T-S-E-D-I. And then the foundation. All right. You can reach us on also on our numbers. 0249-222-990. 0249-222-990. Nine nine zero. My director is also here, so she can also add the head. So I want to thank our partners. Sorry, Insecticide Spray and Quell, our individual supporters, uh, Chedi Pharmacy, KDS Wellness Center, all our media partners, our team members, the people that makes this always, always, always happen. God bless each and every one, and we say God bless every people have made this trafficking thing a business to the less privileges, the vulnerable, 
uh, that vulnerables who sometimes want to go out there to make it in life and pe some people are making this business huge they don't and normally these people don't travel they don't travel they find out the less privileged people who are hungry to make money they take their money from them pack them into any bus anything and then take them out and make their life measurable the disadvantages of traveling without knowing where you are going is very huge one you become a slave to someone's country you, you don't have your freedom and then also um, it is easy uh, for you to go through so much um, trauma trauma because coming back home is another thing when you come back home with nothing it, it's it's a whole business on its own the kind of um, uh, mental health that way and we all know that mental health is a universal uh, uh, fundamental human rights that any person needs to um, get this uh, mental health in, in a good position so for me coming back home I went through a lot I went through a lot I nearly lost it I, I nearly lost I wanted to kill myself let it suicide it and then finish it all because I, I found out that I have lost everything I left my shop I, I lost everything so this trafficking business should stop it should stop this started some years back and it is still going people are still traveling so the book is out to advise many to stop this trafficking many are going through days to have your money but you don't know what people go through out there they go there they are being locked in the room be in the dark some are being raped many are being dragged and uh, I was saying earlier that I was one of the religious personnel and we went we have to pray we have to pray for most of the people before they get their sanity back before they can be in a plane and come back home i went through deportation myself i went i know what this means i know what to go through uh, deportation means what you go through and you coming back home is a whole thing on it also if you come back home and you don't have a good family to hold you in to keep you in and support you you will lose it i ended up Killing myself. It was just one call that made me who I am today. Support Chadi Foundation. This is a very great initiative. I urge everybody to come on board. Any foundation you have, the heart to support, support. Because when we came here, we are very impressed. What the late Christian I just started is still ongoing. They need a lot of support from all over. So Chadi Foundation, God bless your heart. God bless what you are doing, and may God connect you to Destiny Helpers. This is Chadi very foundation. Very we appreciate your love and care. Thank you so much for being there for us. We deeply love you from Becky's children. Love you too. Love you too. <laughs> Thank you for watching Nation One TV. Kindly subscribe for more news updates.